Hi kids! Today we are going to learn about wind energy. So let's start. Kinetic energy of moving air can be trapped to produce mechanical energy that in turn produces electrical energy. Do you know wind is actually a form of solar energy? Let's see how. It is because wind itself is a result of uneven heating of the Earth's atmosphere by the sun. Wind energy or flow of wind can be used in many ways. Sailing, flying kites, big balloons, parachutes, all use this wind energy. Many air sports, water sports, all use this wind energy. Tootway has thousands of animated videos on math, English, and science to clear the core basics of these subjects. And specially created windmills can be used to pump water and grind grains. Big wind turbines are created to produce electricity using this wind energy. Kinetic energy of moving air or the wind turns the blade around the router and this router is attached to the main shaft to the generator that generates electricity. So by using this windmill, wind energy empowers the generator that generates electricity. Wind turbines are mainly of two types. They can be horizontal axes and vertical axes. Horizontal axes, wind turbines are more common. In case of horizontal axes, wind turbines, the rotating axes of the turbine is parallel to the ground and they are mainly used in commercial, big purpose projects, producing electricity at a large scale. This type of wind turbine are generally very high and their installation cost too is very high. They are installed at places where the wind conditions are very consistent. Vertical axes, wind turbines. In case of vertical axes, the rotating axes of the turbine is vertical to the ground or perpendicular to the ground. They are primarily used in small wind projects and residential applications. They are able to work in places where wind conditions are not very consistent and they can rotate in even lower wind conditions. They are not very high. They are closer to the ground. They are quieter and more bird friendly. That is, Lesser number of birds are harmed in case of vertical axes, wind turbines, and these resembles an egg beater. Wind farms. Wind farms consist of many individual wind turbines, which are connected to the electrical power transmission network. Wind farm provides electricity enough for a small city. Denmark generates 40% of its electricity from wind. More than 80 countries in the world are generating power using the wind farm. Almost all cities can generate its own electricity by such wind farms and escape the use of fossil fuels and other non-renewable sources of energy and prevent our Earth from getting polluted and also save our valuable, non-renewable sources of energy.
Tootway has thousands of animated videos on math, English, and science to clear the core basics of these subjects. Now let's learn advantages of wind energy. It is an excellent alternative to fossil fuels available in plenty, obviously renewable, widely distributed, clean source of energy. Produces no greenhouse gas emissions during operation. Uses very little land in contrast to solar power plants. Wind is an inexpensive source of electricity. It is cheaper than coal or gas plants. Now, let's learn some disadvantages of wind energy. Wind power is not very consistent throughout the year. So wind energy can be used in conjunction with some other electric power source so that it can supply energy when wind energy is not sufficiently available. Generating wind power requires very high initial investment, which is even more than fossil fuel generators. But if we compare the wind power operated power plants with fossil fuel power plants on a life cycle basis, then the wind power operated power plants are much more competitive and are less costlier. A large number of birds get killed due to wind power plants. Another disadvantage is that almost all good wind sites are often located at very far locations from the cities and the electricity generated by wind power plants is required to be transported to very far cities. So kids, today we learned a lot about wind energy. Now you may go ahead and take a quiz to learn more. Bye-bye.